Welcome. If you're new here, let me guide you through the Gravity Challenge. Hop in and get started. This recruitment program is designed for engineers who want to work with Sagro, our state-of-the-art gravity robotic technology. If you pass, you will have the honor to do that. If not, you will leave as a jackass. Disclaimer, the gravity unity modifiers allow some basic features for movement and space navigation. We need you to know these features to avoid any injuries and complaints. All sorts of so-called engineers come here, and it's hard to satisfy the needs of everyone. So regardless of skill, all candidates will go through a series of tutorials strategically placed throughout this facility. Now, show us the real engineer in you. The following gravity unity modifiers are not active. Those with yellow corner markers are controlled by the yellow switch.
loose objects will fall in the direction of gravity. <laughs> Duh. Soft structures are light enough to be pushed away or pulled by hand. If you need any help along the way, don't hesitate to ask any of our employees. They are trained to assist in any way possible. Now take the elevator and continue the recruitment program. engineers were building these intermediate tutorial passages, as we call them, for quite some time. The goal is to provide a safe, minimalistic environment for any particular type of movement or trick the GOMs allow. If you learn this now, you can show how well you can perform when the real challenges come into play.
The Gravity Unity modifiers with blue corner markers are controlled remotely with a special handheld device. Well, it's basically a touchscreen LED light remote anyway. Aiming it at such GUM will allow you to activate it. Listen for a beep that indicates a control is on. Your current time is quite good. Not that you could beat the best, though, but definitely enough to beat the jackasses. Keeping this pace, it will take you three hours, 46 minutes, and some minor seconds to complete. <laughs> 